And what is up folks? Today we are going to be finishing up our quick series on this truck. Uh, still wearing the same shirt, a little drier, hey, uh, with Cherry Wet Wax from Detail King. This is the final product that I picked up at their store. Again, not sponsored. These are just products I've been wanting to use and uh, I finally got the chance to get down to their store, purchase them, and uh, now we're gonna use them. Anyways, so the Cherry Wet Wax Premium Carnival Wax. I just got done washing with their black cherry wash and wax. So we are ready and we are prepped uh, to do a little bit of waxing. No, I didn't do uh, the claying on this. Um, I didn't have time. I know that's not extremely the proper way. You should always uh, try and clay before you apply any wax, but time uh, isn't really happening because WrestleMania is tonight and I gotta get done for that. Anyways, anyways. Anyways, uh, <laughs> so cherry wet wax. Uh, let's start out with a, a smell and oh my gosh, like, can you fill it up anymore? Like, oh, oh my God. Oh my gosh. This smells a lot better than a previous wax that I, I really love. Oh my God. Like, can I just, that, that's not, that's not, oh. Anyways, so, um, I, I lost my track of thought. So we're gonna attempt this out today. Uh, this is gonna be used with, uh, I'm thinking I'm gonna be using the uh, uh, black uh, pad for this because it's a soft pad. This does. This isn't any kind of abrasion type wax or anything like that. It's just a regular easy on wax, easy off wax. Uh, shake well, even though there's no room to shake at all. And uh, let's get started on this, all right? Let's do this. All right, so we're gonna get started here. Um, I've already done the rest of my car. Uh, I had to wait for my battery to charge a little bit, so it's all good. So now we're just gonna finish up with the hood. Um, again, Cherry Wet Wax, we're using a black pad because uh, it's the softest one. Uh, again, this is just applying. I could be uh, using a different pad if I wanted to, but um, since we're just testing this out, um, we're just gonna go with a soft pad. You know, five dots right there, how it is, it's all good. Um, I know some people like to do lines, whatever you want to do. If you're using a foam applicator, uh, definitely do the lines and uh, go from there. So let's get started here. Uh, we'll just spread this out a little bit here. Now you say to spread it out until uh, it's kind of vanished, which is kind of... Um, I don't want to say like it's, I've never really experienced that with regular carnauba wax. It's usually just uh, throw it on and then wipe it off. Um, you know, I've dealt with that when you're dealing with, if you're cutting or anything like that um, with a wax. So, you know, we're just going to follow directions because that's what it says on the bottle. Here we go. finish up the other side. go with a plush that's that's my personal opinion though now I, I will say that when I was doing the rest of my car um, I didn't um, exactly spread it as thin as it probably should have because um, again like I said I am in a time crunch today but uh, now that I did on this I regret not doing that because I kind of had a hard time uh, getting some heavy spots off uh, of the truck um, so if you're planning on using this, definitely spread the wax the way that it should. Um, and you know, things will come off much, 
much easier, as you can see here, having zero issues uh, with this wax. And it is so much nicer. And I will say, this protection right here, oh, if you could feel this truck hood right now, insane, insane. Fantastic, like that is just pure protection. And to be honest with you, um, I'm kind of excited to see what is gonna be happening. Uh, we're supposed to be getting some rain like Tuesday. So hopefully the, what do they call it? The hydrophobic properties of this wax will be very good. Uh, I can give you an update possibly in another video to let you know how it was, how well it did. And uh, yeah, so with, uh, with this, I mean, that's uh, that's moving pretty pretty freaking freely right there. Uh, little no no effort. Um, I dig I dig it a lot. I think the hood looks great. All right. So to give my final review on the Detail King Cherry Wet Wax, go for it. Uh, it's it's very easy to use. Uh, again, if you put it on correctly, <laughs> it's super easy to use. Learn from this guy. Uh, but again. You know, that's because I'm a guy, I don't follow directions, and then when I follow directions, I realize, hey, I should have been following directions. Every guy knows what I'm talking about. So yeah, um, Cherry Wet Wax, Premium Carnival Wax, great stuff. Uh, go get it, uh, detailking.com. Uh, again, not sponsored, just a fan of the product stuff now. And we can't forget, oh, how incredible that is. How fantastic that is. So. Definitely check it out uh, on a scale of one to five. I'll give it a four and a half out of five. Reason being, you know, even though there are, uh, even when you do spread it out completely the way it should, there are a little sticky spots. Um, but again, that could also be my fault. Uh, but overall, when you do it super proper, you get a nice result like you do on the hood. Uh, just, you know, keep that in mind because I think some companies like to foolproof their product and I'm a fool most of the time. So that's going to be it guys. Hopefully you've enjoyed these couple of videos that I have uploaded with some new products. Uh, if there's anything new that you would like me to try, go ahead and leave that down in the comment section below. If I'm able to find it, if I'm able to get it, I'll definitely test it out. Uh, with that being said, you guys have a great day. Stay awesome. Keep your car clean and I will see you back here next time. Damn. Uh. Yeah.